Once upon a time in a quaint village, there lived a girl named Amelia. She was known far and wide for her arrogance and pride. Amelia believed she was the most intelligent, beautiful, and talented person in the village, and she made sure everyone knew it. She often boasted about her accomplishments and belittled others with her words. One day, a wise old woman moved into the village. She had a reputation for being kind, humble, and full of wisdom. The villagers admired her and sought her advice on various matters. Amelia, however, saw this as an opportunity to prove her superiority. Do you want to create an awesome animated YouTube video like the one you've just watched for your channel? If yes, then stick along with me to the end of this video because I'll be walking you through a step-by-step -step tutorial guide on how you can create a similar if not exact video to the one you've watched, upload it on your channel, repeat the process, and start generating revenue. Hi, this is Dar Influenza. In today's video, we are going to make it in five parts. The first part is creating the script and prompts. The second part is generating images. The third part is converting the images to 3D video. And the fourth part is generating a voiceover. The fifth part, which is the last part, is editing the video. Let's get started. To create our script, we're going to go to ChatGPT. I'll ask ChatGPT to create a short story of an arrogant girl. Click on enter. Now that ChatGPT has finished creating the story for us, part number two will be generating images. So before we generate the images, we'll ask ChatGPT to write the prompts for our story so that we can create images. I'll click on enter. Now that ChatGPT has written down all the prompts for our story, the last thing I'll ask ChatGPT is to create a title for this story. And ChatGPT has written down a simple short title for our story. Part number two will be generating our images. To generate our images, we'll go to leonardo.ai. We'll go to leonardo.ai. It's on this part that will generate our images. So when we scroll down a little bit, we'll click on AI image generation. Once we we'll click on there, Part two is we'll click on two images, which is the number of images. We'll select two. Then we'll scroll down a little bit and we'll select our dimension to be this one. We will go to ChatGPT. We'll copy our first prompt. We'll go to Leonardo.ai and we'll paste our prompt here and we'll click on generate. Now that our images have been generated, we'll click on download and also download this one. We'll go back to ChatGPT, copy the second prompt, go back to Leonardo.ai, paste, and we'll click on generate. Click on download, also download this one. We will keep on repeating the same process until we finish generating all our images. Our images have been generated, we'll click on download, and we'll also download this one. Now that we have all our images put together, the second thing that we need to do is converting our images into 3D videos. To do that, we'll go to leapixconverter.com and on Leapix Converter, here it says click plus to upload an image and start. So this is the plus button. I'll click on the plus button. It will take me to where my downloads are. We'll start with the first one and I'll click on open. Here there are a number of settings that we can, you can play with to change your dimension, to change the side as to where the image must be rotating to, etc. I'll click on back, click on share, and I'll click on mp4 and save. Now that we've saved our video, I'll click on plus again. I'll go to the next video, sorry, to the next image, I'll click on open and wait for the video to load. Now that the video has been generated, I'll click on share, mp4, and save. We will create the last one. Make sure you do this for all of your images so that you come up with a stunning video for your channel. Now that we've managed to create our 3D videos, the next thing that we need to do is to generate an audio. For us to generate an audio, we will go to Descript. Just go to Descript.com, download the software, and sign up for free. 
Once you sign up, it will land you to this page and I'm sure your page will be blank. So what you need to, to do is come to where it says Drive Workspace. Don't mind the J because that's just the name I used when I was signing up with this software. So just click on Drive Workspace. It will bring you to this page and on this page click on New and come to audio because it is an audio that we would want to generate so just come to audio click on audio give a title to your audio i'll go back to chat gpt i'll just copy the title i'll go back to descript i'll paste my audio here let's just delete this and the next thing i need to do is to press enter to continue with an empty composition i'll just click on enter and here, I'll go back to chat GPT. I'll copy my script. I'll come back to this script and I'll paste my script here. And once I paste my script here, I'll click here where it says speaker and I'll scroll down to where it is stock voices. There are different type of voices you can choose from here, depending with your preferences. As for me, I'll go with the first one, which is Dawn. And the other thing I'd love you to do is click on Dawn. And here where there's an arrow, choose the tone that Dawn must use. Is it angry? Is it calm? Depending with your video, I'll go for come and I'll wait for it to load so that our script will be generated. So once your voiceover has been generated, you see on your timeline it will be different compared to the way it was at the beginning. There are a few things I would love you to take note of when you're here. Number one is the the speed of your, your audio. You can choose depending with your preference which one you would love to go to go with then the other thing is the audio effects there are different audio effects that you can choose while you are on this dashboard or on this platform but for the sake of this video not to be too long we'll just stick to generating the voice over once you have finished generating your voice over come here where it says publish click on publish do not click on download yet click on export and we'll choose our format to mp3 if it's in default format it will be in lawless just choose your format to be on mp3 and click on export very good now that we've generated a story we've generated our images we've converted our images into 3d video we've generated our audio the fifth part is putting all these pieces together so that we can come up with a fully awesome animated youtube video for our channel please stick to the end with me and if you're enjoying this video so far please smash a like button it really mean a lot for us so to edit our video and make it that awesome stunning youtube video that we need we use clipchamp there are a lot of editing softwares that you can use like davinci resolve clipcut and clipchamp there are a lot of them that you can choose and to edit your video so for this tutorial sake we use clipchamp so we'll just come to create a new video and it will land us to this dashboard so we need to drag our media here can click on import so this is our audio that we've created and these are our stunning awesome videos that we've generated as well i'm just going to select all of them i'll click on open and all our videos are being imported here all our media our audio and video are being imported here our entire media has been uploaded here so what we need to do now is to grab our media and drag and drop it here on our timeline i'll start with an audio i'll grab my audio and i'll paste it here on my timeline 
then I'll begin editing my video. Make sure when you are dragging and dropping your your videos, they must be aligned with each line of the script so that you don't miss out on anything. I'll grab the first one, which is this one, and I'll drag it here. Once you drag your, your files here, the other thing I would love you to take note of is the transition. So when you just hover over, when you just hover the end of the video, you will see the plus button. Just click on it to add transition to your video. Delete the space. Add transition. Delete the space. You can also increase the size of your video so that it fits the screen. Just drag, come to the corner and drag the video like this. And here we'll drag it a bit like this. Then we'll come to the center and we'll scrape. We'll drag it down like this. Perfect. Perfect, just like that. Once you are done editing your video, which takes some time, go to export. Click on continue anywhere. And we'll click on high quality. Here on the title of the video, click on edit and we will paste our title like this and we'll click on save to your computer. So that is how you can create an awesome, outstanding YouTube video for your channel. Thank you for joining us in today's video. Please subscribe if you found this video useful. and Let us know if there is any video you would like us to publish on our channel. Thank you.